Yo, what is up, everybody? It has been quite a while since I've played some cart Ruta 9s. No, seriously, I don't even remember the last time I used a cart for that matter. But more importantly, I'm on custom tracks again, and normally I wouldn't want to be playing custom tracks. However, there was a new CTGP update today, and I couldn't help but notice that some pretty spicy tracks got added, and there was some pretty cool looking updates. So I decided. Why not just play some Cart Road and 9 today and see what happens with it? You know, I really didn't want to like get dropped there, but it should be fun. Oh, I'm failing that. Yeah, I went way too far over. Okay, it's been a while since I've played a lot of these tracks at Warpipe Island. Definitely one of my personal favorites. It's not too bad. It's not like busted or anything. How did I how am I in fourth? What? How did everyone behind me fail? You know what? I'm not even going to question. I'm just going to go with it. Maybe we can gain some VR from this room since the last few episodes, I'll admit, I've kind of been throwing pretty much every single time. And well, last I checked, that's not really how you gain VR. So maybe I should consider not doing that. Oh, dang. This guy's like taking a beating out here. And someone else just took a blue. So I'm going to be able to catch up to these top two spots. And that shock, well the only thing that really does is, oh wow, I got a boost from that. Wait, that could be really good if I can get, if I can get my super mini out now. And, uh, okay, I wanted to resize a little bit earlier into it. If I resized earlier into it, that would have been really beneficial for me. Oh my god, I have triple shrooms in first. Um, I kind of want to keep those, so I'm going to shroom early. And I'm going to let this guy pass actually because, I mean, obviously he's going to be faster than me on these turns and... He can take the blues. I don't care. Oh, you thought I was going to go wide there. No. No. Good try, though. Oh, my gosh. You're going pretty slow for a biker, dude. Oh, my gosh. Where is he? Oh, that's where you are. Okay, a little bit laggy, but that's all right. Personally, I'm just going to go around here and use a shroom to make sure I stay with the pack. And stay. Okay, fourth. Nice. He's getting blued. Exactly what I was waiting for. Oh, no. No, 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 Oh my gosh. No, it went so bad so fast. No. Wow. To think that race was going so well until that happened. Oh my gosh. Minus 56 and we're at 9,003. Oh boy. No, 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 no. I'm not trying to dip into 8K right now. No, thanks. Oh, I didn't think I would get hit there. I would have had like third if that didn't happen. Hate to see it, but oh well. I guess I'll have to step it up a little bit if I want to be winning these races. And I kind of threw lap one anyway, so let's see if we can maybe stop throwing now. Well, speaking of really epic updates, this track received quite a visual overhaul and a few changes to the gameplay. And... Looking at it right away, I, I like this. I mean, it's got a nice, you know, cool kind of look going for it. Oh my god, wait, this is so good. Yes! Let me golden away! Yes! I'm just going to go around here. I don't want to risk anything right now. But look at that. Even though it's lap one of Jungle Cliff, it's still good to have, like, some little bit of a lead. Because that way, I have a little bit of a safety net for items that hit me. And I feel like I've said that a lot before, but it's so true. Because, like, one item hit changes so much in this game. Especially on tracks where you have a lot of catch-up potential. On lap 3, everyone can catch up to you so quickly. And honestly, I don't really know how to do this ending session, so I'm just going to do a little bit of a sneak here. Nice, got that going. Oh yeah, also, one thing I should mention before anything else... Yeah, it's been a while since I've, had, I've played Cart Road in Nines. And part of the reason for that is a lot's been going on. And one thing I do want to say on top of all that is I've been working on some stuff for the last week or so. And one of those things including a music channel. I announced it on the community section of my channel already. But I finally made a music channel and I actually uploaded a remix to it not too long ago. So if you want to check that out, head over to the community section of the channel. And check out the link I posted there. It's the link to a remix I made for a contest being held by Alan Walker and FL Studio, which is, you know, the software that I use to make music. 
it would mean the world if you guys were to check it out and you know tell me that tell me if you enjoy it like like and comment on that and share it if you really want it because the more that gets shared you know that's gonna be giving me a pretty good chance to win it and it would be amazing if i could get close to that now back to this race here this that golden really did do astronomical numbers for me because there are no signs of anyone catching up to me right now and it's looking pretty good so as long as i don't run into anything i should be fine the person dodging in second is only going to be like a threat if they have a red and a part of me wants to say they pulled a red right there but the chances of it getting to me i think are kind of slim considering how much of a lead i still have over this person now i'm going to try something here i'm probably going to regret yeah i knew i was going to regret that it just wasn't worth it i thought i could get a good snake going there but it just didn't give me a good alignment at all and no, uh, no, no mini turbo or no trick. My bad. I think that's the best way to do that in a cart. I'm probably wrong about it just because I, I don't really cart that much anymore. That's a good shock for me. That pal would have screwed me over pretty hard. But now I have to make sure that this person behind me doesn't catch up. Okay, you're scaring me. Yes, first place. Nice. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. So happy that I was able to... So happy that I was able to get first. Oh my gosh. Let's go, dude. Okay, I'm so happy I was able to hold on to that. Plus 118 keeps me a little bit safe from that 8k area right now, which is exactly what we love. I want to play a little bit more of the newer stuff because they seem to be favorable for a lot of the combos and carting them seems to be generally fun. So let's hope we can keep getting some of the newer checks just because I want to show them off as well. So <laughs> let's make some magic happen. Oh gosh, Boshi Skate Park. This track is crazy. For all the wrong reasons too. Especially on a cart. Oh gosh. I... Okay, time to figure out whether or not I remember how to do the beginning. If I remember correctly, I kind of just charge a mini turbo into it. And uh... Nope, that's not even close to how you do that. Okay. Let's just go around here and uh, get a trick and uh... At least it's only lap one. On this track, there's a lot that usually happens in a race. Don't don't even think about it. Yeah, it's probably not good that I have shells back here, but I'm just gonna... Really hope nothing bounces off a tree. I, I want to get a dodge item, ideally, because that way... Perfect. Okay. It's already been 30 seconds. I'm gonna wait right here. Nah, actually, no. There we go. Okay. So I guess I need a super mini turbo with a hop into it. That's kind of the way to go about it. And I'm going to chain my star right here. You never know whether or not it'll get used early. Maybe. Maybe. No. Okay, that guy in a star is really scary. Okay. All right. Calm down, bro. Oh my god. Wait, I'm in second. What the heck? How did I get into second? Ah, uh, that's bad. Wait, that's good. Oh, he got owned! Oh, <laughs> that guy got owned! So bad. Oh my, I genuinely feel bad for him. Wow. he That was the freest third of his life and he got packed on the line. Oh, that's so disrespectful. If that was Nuke, if that was you that did that, I, <laughs> man, that's, man, that was too much on him. Wow. Unbelievable. Okay, well, I mean, we gained from it, so that's what matters. I mean, that's kind of what I'm going for, so I'm kind of happy about that. <laughs> this is a track I'm genuinely terrified of online now. Every, every time I've played it in lounge in the past like week or so, I've gotten a bad spot on it without fail. But, oh, actually, well, the last time I played it, I didn't get too bad of a spot. I actually got like, you know, fifth in a 12 player room. So that's not the worst possible thing in the world. But either way, I'm still pretty scared to play this track because I never know. Oh my Lord, what is happening? Okay, I thought like more people died to that fib. So I was kind of confused for a second. But good thing I chained triple shrooms into more triple shrooms. That would have been really saddening if i got any other okay what no no okay well 
Now, now that we're in a bad spot, I can talk about my boy Nuke for some time. For all of you newer viewers, the CT scene really developed itself back in 2013, so to say. And one of the big names at the time was my boy Nuke. Because he used to be one of the best time trialers of all time in the scene. He would have so many BKTs. And what I'm going to do right here is I'm going to golden up. And I don't know if it's a good idea or a bad idea to golden here because I'm just going to golden up. But anyway, Nuke was one of those players to look out for in 2013. He knew so many of the tracks. He had so many of the BKTs. And he was in one of the best clans of all time called the Disasters. And all the BKT holders would be in that clan. And I don't know. It's just really cool to see Nuke playing again after all this time because... He definitely had his inactivity period for some time. Oh, that guy just got owned. Okay, I owned myself. I'm kind of throwing right now. Okay, I need to focus a little bit more on my driving because otherwise I'm going to, like, lose the race. Oh, boy. But either way. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Nice. Got to hold off this guy if I can. The spiral is going to help me a lot with my super, because of my super mini turbos here. Well, that part, not really, but here it'll help. Perfect. That's so helpful. Oh my god, that shock is beautiful for me. Okay. This can either go really well or really badly. Oh my, how did I not get hit by that? Resize me. Thank you. I'm going to back a Nana there just to be safe, but right now it doesn't look like anyone's really catching up to me yet. But like I said, you can never... And I mean, never be sure of anything that's happening. Hmm. A strat that people do here is like hop off into there. I'm going to put a fib there just to be safe. Maybe someone might hit it going onto the ramp. Doesn't look like anyone's going to be hitting it this time around. But I'm still in first, which is what's really important right now. Hopefully I don't get sniped out of first here. That would be really unfortunate. But I'm just so, like, you know, really, really scared because... The ending section is where everything goes down usually. There's usually a lot of shocks, a lot of items. Everything that can happen will happen more than likely. Oh, don't land on that. I'm going for it all right there. Oh, that would have been cool if I got that snipe. Okay, I'll take second after all that. Wow. Okay, I'm just really surprised I didn't get hit by much more there. I was like Nuke is taking a little bit of a beating there, but... Wow, that was an insane, insane race. I don't know why I used Shock that early. I probably could have gotten away with holding it for a little bit longer, but I kind of wanted to get myself to the front because I had a feeling if I got there, I could hold it since the Shocks haven't really been like up to par so far, but they've been effective for the people that use them and getting them into mid spots. So I knew that if I used it early while the pack was close, I could probably get away with it too. And that seemed to work out pretty well. Now, I don't know how many more races I'll do in this room, but it's looking good so far. It's looking pretty good. Well, it looks like we're starting to get a little bit more of the classic tracks, which is unfortunate because I really wanted to show off some of the updates and all that. But either way, this track, I'm honestly going to bag it. it. Every time I try to run it, it's ended badly for me. And I kind of want to avoid that as much as possible. And pulling a bill is probably... Okay, I don't know if that guy was trying to star me or not, but I was a little bit sus, my guy. Gonna have to ask you to calm down there. Now, I don't really know what the best way to drive this track on a cart is, but there's just so many tricks that it almost doesn't matter at all. Like, like look at this. There's just It's just all tricky. <laughs> but I, I seem to be keeping up with everyone just by the amount of tricks that there are on this track. And so, a lot of people are getting owned at this part here. And this should be, yeah. I could use this bill really soon, actually, since, uh... So what I'm gonna do, actually, I'm gonna hop into the cut here. Okay, never mind. I, I wanted to hold that bill a tiny bit longer so that I could, you know, take the cut with it. Okay, I thought... Wow, really? That's why I wanted to hold it. I had a feeling that if I was able to hold bill, I might have been able to dodge that shock. But that's not too important right now. And I have to go around here because I learned the other day, the hard way, that you actually can't make some of these jumps while small. And 
As unfortunate as that is, I guess it makes some sense because, you know, gotta be able to take the main route sometimes. Now, if I get really lucky here, maybe I'll get... Oh, or that can happen. Oh, no, 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 no. Wow. Okay. I actually thought I had a little bit more room to move there, but I, I guess I just didn't. <laughs> My bad on the bad prediction there. And if I'm going to be honest, I'm predicting a spam shock here. But... My predictions are usually kind of off. I'm gonna golden now because if I use it, yeah, that's why I wanted to use it right then and there. Um, man, I really don't know what to expect now. I'm just gonna go up here. Oh, I'm gonna go for an item actually. Cause I feel like I can get something good here. That's a good item. Can I make the most out of it though? Ah, uh, I either got sixth or seventh. I'm not sure which one though. I, I wanted to play it safe there and not go for the ending strat since I had all the extra speed in the star, but what are we getting? Ah, uh, sixth and minus 24. Really small loss, but that's nothing too bad by any means considering how that track plays. I'll say that ended up pretty well. And the fact that I still beat the guy, I think that, I think that was the guy that got blued. Considering I still beat him, I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. We take those. Oh, let's go, GBA Mario Circuit. Another chaotic track. Wait, why am I cheering for a chaotic track? You know what? Probably just because it's GBA Mario Circuit. Like this, this was this was another track that Daisy Squad had a lot of interest in when it first got added to the pack. And I'll be honest, I'll never understand why we had so much interest in it. I'll just know that we did. And that's probably more than enough information about it. <laughs> a star is amazing here because shock usually can't be acquired until the very end of lap one unless someone just hard bags at the set. Like the guy across the set at 27 seconds, so he's probably not going to be able to... Shock won't be obtainable until this set right here. And then it still comes down to whether or not they're going to get the box. Like, I don't think anyone got a box there, so shock is more than likely going to be obtained right up here. And whether or not they spam it, that's a mystery. I, I personally think he's going to chain it. Oh my god, I just went over the ramp. That was really scary. So I believe he's going to chain it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to chain my star. Is he going to use it? He's not going to use it. I'm going to golden up since I see Chavis as a red. And I kind of don't want to be caught up in the middle of that. Oh shoot, I see my boy Nuke up here. Ah, there's the shock. I was wondering where it was going to happen, but I'm kind of surprised it happened there of all places. I guess he just wanted to chain it first set lap three. Since it's, you know, that's probably a good place to chain anyway. Oh, this is so bad. Uh, I'm probably getting fifth or sixth here. But actually, no. I think I should be taking fourth. Yes! Okay. Wow, I did not expect to keep a top spot there. Maybe Nuke was having mercy on my soul. Maybe not, I have no idea. But 9,300, we've made a pretty good climb so far this episode. I'm, I'm, okay, this is good. Definitely making some strides right now, which is important because I can't remember the last time we made any sort of strides, but. <laughs> wow, that is really sad. All right, I'll do like three or four more races in here and we'll see how high we can get or how much we'll lose. I really hope it's not the, not the other way. That would be really, really, really bad. But, I don't know. Only one way to find out. Alright, nice. Desert Castle Raceway. Gotta love it. This has always been a really fun track. And the update made it a little bit better. Because now the ending ramp isn't as jank as it used to be. Like, it's still a little bit jank, I'll admit. I mean, it, the fact that it just sends you really high for no reason is kind of dumb, not gonna lie. But that, that's not what I want to talk about right now. What I'm talking about right now is how fun this track is. It's always been a lot of fun. I just love driving it for whatever reason. Now I'm on, yeah, I had a feeling that was going to happen. I'll wait. And I'm not going to wait for shock though. Because I, I don't, I don't want to base my gameplay too hard around that. I'd rather base my gameplay off of, you know, going for a prediction or staying close with the pack. That's what, that's what matters the most right now. If I can maintain that, then that's really good. A lot of the times what I see on this track is that people chain the shock, like, in before the... 
ruins section. I don't even know what section you call it. I call it the ruins section. Maybe that's not what you call it. But I'm going to chain it here anyway and see what happens. I mean, he's probably not going to use it. But... Oh, nuke. Okay, thank God. I, I didn't want to start my boy. Oh, someone just hit that fib. Like, brutally. All right, well, using this golden is just going to get me up into, like, a decent spot here. And I'm probably going to get owned by the wall here. Yeah. But that's pretty good. I mean, I thought I would get way more owned if I hit the wall there. But surprisingly, no. Hmm. I don't think anyone's going to use a shock anytime soon. Usually in Mogi, we're, we have people dodging their teammates in the cannon. I don't... I would hope we're not getting anything like that right now. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was... A pretty weird trick. That's an interesting shock. Using it into the cannon rather than, you know, after the cannon. So that no one else gets items. But who am I to judge the shock usage of, you know, everyone in this room. Since I'm not even in first right now. I'm still fighting for a spot up here. And someone else is getting blued. So I guess it's pretty good that, I was, you know, that I've been staying in the back this whole time. And normally I would want to, you know red nuke but oh my god what is happening i'm running you oh please hit please hit nice i don't think he has a chance of passing it okay that was really lucky i think the snaking there was really beneficial for me especially having the outward drift because i was able to like juke him out a little bit and that's definitely very okay well that shot just canceled out me getting owned by the fire stick i'm gonna wait actually there's a lot of people here and they're probably gonna pass me so if i wait here i can get an item box and i can probably get something useful yeah that's a very useful item for example so what i can just do here is take the cut and i'll be right back in like seventh or something yeah sixth even wow okay if i can get something good here um the only why oh i forgot sneak steer just can't take that turn that's so bad what I can do here is just pow everyone after boxes, because that way, no everyone has to use their stuff. That was a really bad ramp for me. Oh, this is so bad. I need a cannon dodge if I want to have a chance at this. Ah, it doesn't look like it. That's alright. If I can get shocked here, that would be cool. Uh, I think I'll be taking 7th this time around. Wait! Ah, oh, I thought someone fell off. Wow. Alright, looks like I'll have to take 7th there. Really unfortunate stuff, but I guess you got I guess I gotta live with it. I guess it happens. It's probably gonna be another really small loss, but that won't affect me too much. We'll see what it's looking like. Minus 46. Alright, we just lost like pretty much what we gained last race and a little bit more. Which isn't bad by any means. I mean it's still good. We're still on an overall game. That's what matters at the end of the episode. So let's hope we can keep it that way. Oh gosh. Melting Magma Melee. Oh no. As much as I love this track, this is going to be challenging to get a good spot on. And I really, really hope I don't get, you know, too screwed at the beginning. But this is fine because if I can get triple shrooms here... Wow, okay, you just went way out of your way for that. Oh, I'm happy you got a TC because of that. Yeah, that's deserved, man. I don't care. <laughs> Hopefully you get shrunk by it, too. See if I care, bro. All right, give me shrooms. Give me shrooms. Nice. Perfect item. That guy got TC'd. Life is looking really good right now. If I can make the shortcut, I'll be even happier. Now, am I going to be able to make it? Oh, God! Let me stay on. Okay, I'm on the track. Wow. I did not think I was going to be on the track after that one. I genuinely thought I was off. Okay, that's really good. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do here because this is a crazy section of the track. I... Yeah, I forgot that I can't do drift stuff like that there. And that is really bad. Okay. In a really bad spot now because I kind of forgot how the drifting physics work on that super downhill. So, my bad there. And, uh, I'm gonna... Uh, do I want to throw this right away? Probably, since first place is pretty close still. I want to keep it that way. I don't want anyone to, like, break away on this track. If anyone breaks away on this track, they're pretty much guaranteed to have it. And that's the last thing I want. Oh my god, three people got hit by that. And I'm in fifth off of it. Okay, this is huge. 
And I don't want that TC, really. Uh, really bad section for me. I'm gonna chain... Eh, no, I'm not gonna chain this. I'll chain it second set, because I feel like it'll get used there. Or, they'll chain it first set if they get it. And then I'll be able to chain something else. So let's see if I can predict it. I'm gonna use my Mega now. Get to take this little cut as well. Since, you know... Activate! Come on! Ah, that would've been cool if they activated it. But, I can only ask for so much, you know? I gotta be generous. Or, you know, I can't be too greedy with it. Because, you know, if I get too many things that go my way, then there's bound to be some bad luck that comes with it. Uh, no. No, you don't. You thought. Okay, this is a little bit close for comfort. Okay. Ah! Woo! Okay. Okay. All right. That was scary, but that's enough of that. No more jump scares, please. Okay. Okay. That guy goes through the banana, by the way. I am very terrified. Okay. Oh. Please let me live. Please, 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 please. Okay. Third will be more than enough. If I can keep third, I'll be content with that. Okay. Whew. Please don't back me. Please don't back me. Please don't. Duh. I couldn't drift. Ah, uh, I messed up there. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, Ninja Mage. Oh, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. What? No! I messed up! Wait, oh, I'm so good at the game! No way! There's no way I'm getting fifth. There's no way. There's no way! There's no way I'm getting fourth after that! No! <laughs> that's so undeserved. That is so undeserved. I don't care, man. I'm trying to gain. That is the most undeserved race of all time. Oh, no. <laughs> I probably would have kept third too if I didn't fall off there. Oh my gosh. Am I gaining for that? I'm gaining for that. That's unbelievable, man. You know what? Alright, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do one more race and see like how ridiculous it's gonna end up. Cause part of me says it's gonna be ridiculous. And if it is, then it will be. But let's hope we can end this episode off with a banger. Alright. I'm changing my mind a little bit. Depending on how this race goes, that will decide how long this episode goes. And we'll, we'll determine that at the very end of the race. But for now, Yoshi's Woolly Raceway. Pretty solid track, obviously. I played the- Okay! That's a crazy start. I played this one a number of times now. It's- it's- it's really fun. Like, I'm actually surprised with how, how much fun I have playing it. And it never disappoints either. Like, no matter where the shot gets used, you always get a crazy close race. Because everyone always has time to come back on lap 3. And there's not really much you can do about it. Whether you like it or not, this is one of those tracks that favors really big comebacks. But front running is possible. It's not impossible by any means. But, you know, it's generally looked down upon. Alright, activate shock. Use it! Use it! Oh god! Uh, where did the other guy go? Oh, there you are. Uh, I don't. Oh my god, I get another blue. I'm bluing you after the next set. Uh. Oh, that's awkward. Uh, well, at least I didn't get past the TC. That's what matters at the end of the day. Now, can I get a star? Oh, Chavis. Hey, give me a star. That's not a star. I'm gonna try to get a star here. Because I feel like Shock's gonna be chained either last set or first set. And I wanna be ready for that. I don't wanna be missing out when that happens. Uh, am I gonna be able to get one though? That is the question. Dang, that is very rough actually. But the good news is I can golden up here. So if I start, if I, you know, go up here, start goldening. Then, if he doesn't pull shock, I'm gonna be able to take this first cut. And, uh... Alright, I, I just had to say something, didn't I? Oh, did that guy have it? Or, I already forget. Uh, Blitzcrank. Did he have it? Wow, okay, I'm kind of surprised. But, and, as, as, I'm, as I was saying before, we have an insanely close pack now. And I don't know 
how this could possibly end. This could end any way, really. This could either end really badly or really well. There is still time for something really good to happen here. And honestly, what I'm about to do, I'm gonna chain this here. This gun being... Looks like I'm not being forced to. I need a shock here. Oh, shoot! Oh, shoot! Let's go! Come on! Give me that second place! Give me that second place! Let's go, baby! Woo! Nice! Okay. There was no... I did not expect that, honestly. <laughs> That's the last thing I expected. Oh, let's go, man. 93.82. Okay. So, the condition that I was talking about here. I'm not ending the episode yet. What I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna play until a very specific track gets picked. However, if it doesn't get picked in the next, like, three to four races, I'll definitely call it off there. So, let's make it happen! Okay, this is another track that I genuinely don't know what approach to take every time I play it. Like, it feels like something different will work. So I'm gonna do it. I mean, am I gonna regret it? More than likely. Will I know if it's a good idea or a bad idea? Probably not. And right there, that's an example of a very bad idea. But it's okay, because a golden isn't much use to me anyway. Triple shrooms, on the other hand... Okay, well, that's just not a useful item, but that's all right. So this guy is not going to get a box till 30. No one's going to have a chance at shock until a little bit after 30. And the question then is, does he spam it? And now what I'm wondering is, does Bill take this cut? It does not take that cut. Okay, that was a very bad idea. I should not have done that. Wait, where? What happened? Oh, I, I just shouldn't have built there. That was very bad on me. Wow. If I didn't build there, I would be in a very good spot right now. But that's alright. No one... Doesn't seem like Shock's gonna get used anytime soon. Unless he just pulled it there and he was... Okay, that, that was... That, that, that was what I was worried about. I was worried about whether or not he was gonna spam it there. But there seems to be a little bit of a break between, you know, bottom four and me. So that's all good. As long as that stays the same, then I'll be fine. Because I, I like seeing a little bit of a break. You know, it gives me a little bit of relief. Doesn't put takes a little bit of pressure off of me. But that right there, that was not something that takes a little bit of pressure off of me. And what I'm actually gonna do now is I'm gonna... Well, that actually helps, surprisingly. Because what I can do now is jump down here, grab a box, and hopefully... What? That's not what I want. I'm back bombing you, by the way. Just because I can. Now, if I can get a shroom here, we'll be in business. But can I get a shroom? I can't! I'm back bombing this guy too. Because I want to take some top spots. Okay, nuke. Okay, nuke going off. I really don't know what I should do in this situation because, I mean, with all the bikes around me, I'm more than likely going to be losing this scenario here. Being in sixth isn't too bad either because, uh, uh I would have, I would have loved to keep those shrooms, but if, it, if it's going to be like that, Oh, the box was, wasn't was there, or was there on your screen. Or, you know, the type box wasn't there on your screen. Okay, that's kind of odd, actually. I'm kind of surprised about that. I'm not going to take this cut again because it's a little bit risky. Kind of low re kind of low reward in my scenario because, you know, I got Super Mini Turbo to carry me anyway. Um, yeah, I don't know the best way to take that, but... Yeah, I made a tutorial and all that, but I still don't know the best way to take it. Because what I'm concerned about right now is this guy behind me. What? That's not what I expected to happen. Give me shock. Use it. Use it. Use it. Come on. Just spam it, dude. Give me eight. Eight? Maybe? All right. I'll, I'll take eight after all that. Wow. I, I did not think that would happen. That's probably the last thing that I would have happened. Oh, man. 9303. Oh, that's looking bad. All right. I'm going to give it two more races to pick the track. Because this definitely wasn't the track I had in mind. A different track is what I'm thinking of. And I really want to play it. But I'm only willing to give it two more races to pick it. Otherwise, I'm definitely going to call it call it an episode there. Oh boy, Desert Ford. Okay, another track that's still quite popular. A lot of the newer tracks seem to be the more popular ones. But I still can't play the one that I want to play. Oh man. Alright, this, this race will determine... 
is going to be determined by a few things. And first and foremost, it's going to be determined by whether or not I can remember how to... What? Okay, nice teleporting Rosa. Uh, you're an Omega, so I'm going to go over here. And yeah, I'm actually just going to... I don't really mind how much time I lose. Like I said, it's, it's lap one, so... I don't really lose the most amount of time in the world by doing that. Okay, but now I'm actually starting to lose a bit of time by doing that. All right. Um, oh, there's 11 players in the room. Okay, that's actually a little bit significant because now I can get shock here. Either that or Chavis is going to get really lucky and pull it. Okay. I don't think he has it. And I, yeah, he definitely doesn't have it. Now, the question is if anyone's going to, if he's, if the guy is going to get it right here. Or driver. Okay, that's an interesting me name. I don't know what type of me name that is. Are you are you gonna use it? That is the question. Normally I'd go for something right there. Oh, I'm gonna hold this for a little while because I want to have a little bit of a safety net. And he's definitely. Is he gonna chain it? I'm not gonna use my star because I'm not certain of it. But okay, he didn't chain it. So the question then is when he's gonna use it. Like, I, I don't know when he's going to use it. He doesn't seem like he's going to use it anytime soon. So, I'll, I'll, I'll stick with that chance. Now, if I see him go around, I'm obviously going to use my star immediately. Because that's, you know, a huge implication that he's going to chain. And I have to use this anyway. Alright, can we use it? Uh, Alright, well, I made that surprisingly, so... I'm still in fourth, though. And this guy has a TC, and you're scaring me. Where did you go? Oh, that's a really good shot for me, actually. Because now I got pushed back into six and I can get a good item here. And when I resize, I can take the shortcut here. And I can go up here, too, since I'm already resized and that doesn't affect too much. Now, if I can remember how to play this ending section, that would be really cool. Uh, I'm gonna use a shroom just because I don't want to be stuck in the dirt for too long. And do I ch I'll chain this one up. Oh wow, that was way worth it. What? That that's wow. But that, now I'm now I'm really gonna be playing a risky game here. I'm I'm really about to be playing with the shock here, because my entire race right now gets determined by whether or not he holds the shock. And he doesn't. Ha I th yeah, he has an item for sure. But is he gonna chain it or is he gonna is he gonna hold it for the very end? That that's what determines my race here. Now I'm gonna chance this. Never mind. I guess that answers my question. But since I got shot before boxes, that's actually a very acceptable situation. Um I'm really playing with fire here, but I'll bite. I'm actually gonna chain a box out here too. Oh my god, wait a minute. That's so good. Wait. Wait. Oh my, wait a minute. What? No. What? 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 How did they get first? What? What just happened? What just happened there? What? what? Wow. I I'm genuinely surprised that I actually won that race. All right, well, I'm gonna stick to my word. I'm going to give it one more race, and if we don't play it next race, well, no matter what, next race is gonna be the end of the session. So let's hope we can play the track I wanna play. Well, it's unfortunate that we weren't able to end on the track that I was looking for this whole time, but I think Lava Lake is gonna be a fine track to end on. Mostly because I feel really comfortable with it now that I've played it so many times in lounge. And if I get Bill here... Okay, that's excellent. Wow. Best possible item I could have pulled there. And Rolanda. I don't know who that is and I don't know if I want to know. But either way, you're, you're going to be my little buddy for this race. Oh, no, you're going that way. Okay. Well, that increases my chances of getting shock. And I'm actually going to wait that out. Oh, that's awkward. Well, I was really expecting, you know... Oh, hey, Nuke. Um... Nah, screw it. I'll just use the star here. Oh! Well, 
That's definitely awkward. But now the question is, how long do I hold this? No, really, how how long do I hold this? I actually have no idea. Do I want to dodge nuke? I don't know. Okay, you had a ground shroom. That was kind of scary. Uh, I'm going to use it there. I thought for sure someone would drop a star or something. Kind of surprised. I'm going to use it here just because. I mean, I want to get another good item, and I feel like I can get something good. Okay, well, I really just should stop saying stuff like that. Wow. That was not a very good chain. Then again, I am in fifth, so that wasn't the worst possible change. And I get a mega. Okay, that's actually just incredibly lucky. What? No. What do you think you're doing, buddy? Don't don't play that game with me. You're, you're gambling with a lot if you think that game is going to end up well for you. Shock should be obtainable about now. So he's probably going to get it first set. But I don't expect him to spam it. So what I'm actually going to do here is I'm going to take this cut in a mega. Now, is he going to use it? That is the question. Probably not. Okay, that's fine. But now I need to worry about whether or not I'll be able to hold on to third. Because someone's probably going to take that cut. Okay, that was a scary little banana. No. Okay, looks like I'm keeping third, so this should be a gain. Let's go, baby. Okay. Well, really unfortunate that I didn't play Mushroom Valley, but that race ended up a lot better than I expected it to, especially after how bad that shock was for me. Plus 71. We're back at 9.5. Oh, shoot. Let's go, baby. That is exactly what I like to see. I think, I think almost a 500 point gain throughout this entire episode. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm fine with that. I think, well, I think I'm think i definitely down to call an episode there. Let's go, man. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Cart Road and Nines. I decided I might as well make this one a longer episode since it's been over a month now since I've uploaded an episode of this series and once again, I apologize for not uploading much. I'll elaborate a little bit more in the pinned comment. So read that if you want to know what's been going on to some extent. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Check out my music channel in the community section of the channel. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.